What companies have to do in terms of fixed asset control, depreciation, and so forth has recently been a new requirement of governmental units, states, counties, towns, villages. GASB 34, GASB being the Governmental Accounting Standards Board, GASB issued uh, statements 34 and 35, which require governmental units to do exactly what companies have been doing for the last 30, 40, 50 years. Governmental units now have to have a fixed asset register of what the assets they own are, and they have to compute and report the depreciation expense related to those assets. In the past, governmental units simply wrote off, in effect, to expense all expenditures on uh, anything that they made. And let's just take a highway if, or a road. If a county built a road, the expenditure for that road just was part of the current year's uh, budget for the town or the county or the village. Under the GASB 34 now, the governmental unit must record the cost of the asset and apply depreciation in the future until the asset is disposed of or fully depreciated. All of the internal control requirements for private enterprise corporations that have to follow GAAP and report to the SEC if they're public or privately held. All those requirements, in effect, have now been laid on the governmental units, and this really uh, removes one of the biggest differences between government and the private sector that there was, because now governments have to do the same uh, accounting, have the same controls, and in the long run, while it's going to add to the costs of government, a very modest amount in my judgment, it is going to benefit taxpayers dramatically by knowing what it is that the money is being spent on and what the annual cost, either depreciation or maintenance, is for the ownership of those assets. So in my judgment, GASB 34 and 35 were a great step forward, long overdue, and while there was opposition by governmental accountants because they didn't want to incur the cost. As a taxpayer, I think it was well uh, in the public interest to have these statements issued.